Go. What's up, neighbors? Welcome to the jail. This is my hydraulic tank class scooter, as you can tell. Today, we're gonna work on this cluster. We'll show you the process of what we've done to it and the process what of- What have you done to it? It looks less than before. So we kind of went snippy snip with it. We took a sawzall to it and just had some fun. Just cut that off. Exactly. Make it more look like make it look more like a race car. What's Let's what's the plan today with it? Today we're gonna clean it up, tear it down so it's just the metal frame, so we can clean up the frame and make it. Look we're gonna paint, are we gonna paint the same color as the bar? That or purple. We'll see. Okay. So yeah, should be a good video. Peace out. Oh gosh, that broke. Um. <laughs> yep. Did it come out? Up? Ha ha! I am a genius. That one doesn't come out quite easily. But we got her. Oh, wait. Get this play out of the way. There we That's go. That's just a classic piece. It's the power of teamwork. Teamwork sucks. Owie! Just turn it sideways. <laughs> oh, that's too smart. <laughs> So that's a lot of wiring. I, stuff, I see a lot of rust. I don't know what you're talking about. Was it hanging out with an RX-7 or something? Dude, it was hanging, it's the Dorito dust. <laughs> what are we gonna do? We're gonna clean that up so we can paint it. Clean this up so we can go back in there and then we're gonna throw her in. Literally like, just we're just gonna throw in. it in? Yeah. It doesn't, Dope. doesn't need to be put in, it just needs to be thrown in. Sounds good. Just on to play is that you get into neutral? No, you like this. It'll work out. So we got it cleaned up and separated. Oh, I'm gonna show them the, uh, the how good of a job you did cleaning the gauge cluster. Look how shiny yeah, that, that looks. It looks. He just broke the fuel gauge. <laughs> I, I mean, the, the temp, temp gauge, temp gauge. You don't need to know what temperature it is anyway. But I mean. Cleaned it up, now we're gonna paint it. It's not gonna be the cleanest job ever. We're gonna redo it down the line. But yeah. It should work for now, at least. So yeah. Let's get painting. Okay, so we've got the the paint on. It's looking pretty pretty matte black. So uh, we should let it we should let it dry and uh, get it on. Freaking mint. What did you have to say for yourself? Cancer. Okay. We're, we're here to install this the gauge. Seat belt. No, this is a seatbelt. This is a seatbelt? Oh, I like the seatbelt strap. And is, it, is this like the buck? Which one of these? Oh! <laughs> what? I know what that black piece was that fell out a while ago when I was cleaning it. You know that stopper thing that stops the gauge from going too low? It's not really there anymore. <laughs> that explains why it took so long for it. Ooh, aggressive. Ooh, <laughs> aggressive. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be as much power as this thing has. Make sure you scratch the window all the way down. Okay, okay. Who even like needs? That. Who even needs a rest of a dashboard? Just, just like that. You Perfect. just need the gauge cluster. It's, it's done. Like, it's ultimate weight reduction. Oh, I, so that was the install, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Catch y'all next time. Hmm. Wait a second. Oh, <laughs> only a select few have a skill. Do you have what it takes? Go to do a freaking like full blown like army recruit. <laughs> ah! Switzerland, I feel like just. Ah! We're just gonna ignore that. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna ignore that. Sounds good to me. That's what they all said too. Mm -hmm. So when installing something, you want to make sure you don't know where it's going. Yeah, that makes sense. I just kind of fit it in there and hope for the best. Oh, wait a second. This was going underneath, isn't it? There's a little thing that goes over there. Over what? There's a little plastic piece that goes over. Like next to my thing. It's not plastic, it's metal technically. I think that's as far as it'll go. I am so confused right now, man. Yeah, that's as far as it'll go. Here, hand me a, 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 a bolt. Here's your bolt. Thank you. 
Oh, you mean that thing over there? What thing? Is that supposed to go between the dash and the other thing? There should be a long metal part. Yeah, it's long and metal. Yep. Huh. Imagine that. Dang, dude. Let me just get a... Let me just get a nice little aerial shot. Let me just take this out. Just take it out. Go put it over there. Okay. And I can get that nice aerial shot of you. Look at that. Look how good that dashboard looks. Are you happy with it? My clutch doesn't work. You don't have a transmission, buddy. That's all it works. Cool beans. Okay, that's not, not, not happening. So we got the dash finished and it's installed, at least for now. We're probably gonna take it out and paint it again. You got eventually. your you got buttons and a steering wheel. But again. we have all the buttons from when it you know, how it was before. Got all hooked up. So I guess What's next, next step, headliner. Next is probably st stripping the interior more. More like the interior back half stuff. Of the interior. What about we gonna take like, the speakers out and stuff and put new speakers? Yeah, we'll figure it out later. But first, we're probably gonna strip all this stuff out. All the headliner, all the grossness, the remain, the foam of the headliner. This will probably help us not smell like cigarettes. Probably. So that's probably the last of it that stuff that actually smells like that. Let's see, let's find out. Uh, anyway, I taste it. <laughs> Shoves it in your mouth. So yeah, we'll next time we'll probably do some interior work. Something. We'll have to do something. But she's getting she's moving along a lot more than she used to be. And now you got a job, so you can actually you can actually buy an RV now. Once I you, do uh, have a job now, so I can actually afford things. I right. also have different kinds of content too, probably coming up next That's year. That's true. Peace out.